Well, it is a big week here at the Colts Complex. The season opener is a week and a half away down in Jacksonville, and by this upcoming Saturday, rosters have to be shortened and solidified. So emotions will be running high for those guys who are teetering on the cut line as they try to make their final impressions while the coaching staff and front office make their final decisions. Still doing some head to head competition against each other, so still looking to make progress this week. There's still important things to work on. This practice field will look a lot emptier next week. The Colts current 79 man roster will be chopped down to 53 and that's no easy task. Head coach Frank Reich believes this is the strongest roster they've had. I look from uh, at every position group and, and I see winning football, so expectations are high. You have guys like Darius Leonard and Jack Doyle who can rest easy knowing their place, but others will be sweating it out on Saturday. It's a crowded wide receiver room, so who will they keep? Who will win the kicking job to replace Adam Vinatieri? And how about the undrafted free agents looking for their big break? Cornerback Kenny Moore II was once that guy, a rookie who didn't hear his name called in the draft. He had to work his way onto this roster. He knows the grind and how much harder it is this season, especially without preseason games. If I was in their position back in 2017, uh, I think my chances would be even slimmer. When I tell the younger guys here or anybody that, you know, thinks that they're in a bubble or whatever, you know, just take advantage of your opportunity. Each practice is like a game, so you got to go into practice thinking, you know, you have to minimize your mistakes. Offensive lineman Mark Lewinsky remembers what cut day was like back in 2018 when he wasn't sure if he'd make that final roster. The best thing is not to get a call. So you know, I was like, I told my family and stuff. I said, unless you, unless there's like an emergency, I said, don't even bother to, to call or anything because I was so, you know, you get so nerve wracked and everything like that. So I was just like, you know, just leave me be. You want to make yourself in the most comfortable position and leave it up to fate, you know. In the end, things worked out for Kenny Moore and Mark Lewinsky, and now there's a new crop of players hoping Saturday works out for them too. At the Colts Complex, I'm Taylor Tannebaum. And the Colts are counting down to kick off. The team just announcing its new sweepstakes. Registration opens tomorrow for a chance to win a private suite at the home opener September 20th. Free Colts schedule posters are going to be available beginning next Tuesday at Bell Tire locations. The Colts will also host a free drive-through flag giveaway on Monument Circle next Friday morning, September 11th.